Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. In this video, we are going to give Core Java challenge number 35. And this challenge is about a string mutability, I mean string immutability. We know that in Java, string objects are immutable. What is that immutability? Immutable object state, immutable object state, state means what? The data information cannot be modified, cannot be modified once it has been created. The state is final state and where string objects get memory in a pool area, string pool area. And suppose if you want to create two string objects with the same content, nothing but duplicate strings, duplicate strings share the same memory location C. Here the task is what? Just create two string objects with the same content and check, check the memory address of both the objects. Definitely, it will show that same address for both the objects because the content is the same. And next one, modify one string because we have created two string objects, right? Modify one string. How to modify means what? By concatenating any other content. Initially, both are equal. Next, both are not equal. As soon as you modify the string, then a new memory will be allocated, will be allocated to modified string. For example, if you are creating two strings, one is a, here it is just Naresh, and S2 is also Harish, just consider. Now, here it is uh, these two objects get memory at the same location. If you check that address, how to check the address, you have to write the code. And next one, just modify that S2 dot, just concat, just concat that. Concat S2 modify to Naresh IT, suppose. So, then it gets a separate memory allocation. Memory address will change. S1 is pointing to that same location that is called immutability. When, when two objects having that same, same content pointing to same location, as soon as you change, as soon as you modify, then it is pointing to another location. That is, you should write the code for this explanation and comment your code. Thank you.